What's up guys, it's Evan and Ever here, and today I'm bringing to you the second episode of the Fable 3 series to my channel. So, last episode, Elise, I had to choose between Elise and the people, man, and I chose Elise. I had to cut that bitch off, man. Too crazy. Cut her off. I, so, I don't know if she died or not, because they didn't show it, but I killed her. I cut her off, man. The people, man, they, they make you. You're the king. But, so, we're going to continue this series. Let's whistle to the homie dog. Why is it whistle? Come on. Come on, man. What the fuck? Alright. We gotta follow Walter. It's like we're like in a desperate escape to leave the castle, apparently. So. Oh, and I don't know if you guys noticed, but last episode, it was laggy as balls. Like, I was walking slow as shit. I thought it was just that, like, it was like the whole game was going to be like this, since it was like... It was like it was like originally made as an Xbox 360 game, and it's just how it was gonna be. But I guess it was cause like it was like the first like time I played it, and like my Xbox wasn't used to it or some shit like that. So I don't know. But now it seems to be working fine. So yeah, pretty good, pretty good. But there's something we must do first. So yeah, I wanted to talk to you guys about something. I'm gonna play the game. I'm not gonna talk so much throughout this episode about the game. But today, so today. I had a really bad fucking day. So, in every state, I'm pretty sure you have to get a car inspection for your car. Like, it's a safety inspection to make sure everything's safe when your car so that you're not driving down the road and your brakes give out and you fucking go off a cliff. Or like, shit like that. <laughs> so, I get my vehicle safety inspection done like three weeks ago. And, where am I doing? Okay. And... Two things failed. I had my my uh, rear head, real tail lights. My tail lights failed because they had like paint on them. Because the guy before me put like fucking like try to tint them with his paint. So I removed that with peroxide. And then um, my brake lines failed. Both my rear brake lines. So my dad was like, the guy was trying to charge it two hundred fifty dollars, and the parts are fifty dollars, right? So the guy was like, well, it's eighty dollars an hour of labor. I was like, what the fuck? So my dad was like, no, nah, I'll just fix it. I was like, okay, hell yeah, you're saving me $200. So first off, my dad's the type of guy who turns like a one-day project into like a three-week project. Literally, that's what happened. One-day project turned into three weeks of me not having a car. So yesterday, he finally fixed it. It got finally done. So today, I took it back to the guy to get it re-inspected. So keep in mind, I had to pay another 34 bucks just for this guy to fucking jack up my car. Just to jack it up. So I'm like, all right, whatever. He checks it out. He's like, hey, come here. He's like, you failed. I was like, what the fuck? How did I fail? He's like, this line's not bent the right. This line's not like this. And it was leaking fucking uh, brake fluid and all this shit. So I was like, oh my God. Are you kidding me, man? So I was like, well, how much is it going to cost now to get it fixed? He tells me 475 bucks because my dad apparently fucked something up. So I was like, what the fuck? So, and I had to get it done, because if I wouldn't have get it done, you have, like, a 30-day, like, span after you, um, after you get it inspected, and if you fail to get it fixed, and if not, you have to get it re-inspected, I would, I would have to pay another 60 bucks. So, I was like, I'm not going to pay another 60 bucks, so I was like, fuck it, just fix it, I'll come pick it up Monday, I'll pay you, I won't have to deal with this car anymore. So, I guess the whole moral of the story is, kids, don't fucking grow up, because growing up sucked big, giant dick. I hate it oh my god just having to pay your own car insurance having to pay for your car having to pay for everything on your own it fucking blows and i guess the the other moral story is is like ultimately if if the deal's not that bad in the first place for a mechanic i know it sounds kind of sketchy just get them to do it because they're professionals they know what they're doing and i was kind of stubborn so i could have paid 250 bucks but now i gotta pay 475 bucks, so I'm fucking retarded. So, fucking back into the game. I know where the hell we're at. Um, we're in like some. I don't even know where we are, honestly. I'm like off track. But yeah, that was my little rant for the day. Hope you guys enjoyed that. We're like in some like misty. Some misty land. Alright, so. Why is my butler a ghost? Just gotta read the hero plinth. And Sir Walter Beck, who will be <coughs> Shit, what do I gotta do? You have already taken the first Co op plinth. Walk through the gate and claim your reward. 
Go, bitch. Open the door. I want to be a hero. I don't want to be a co-op. Fuck. I'm also just going to take all the kills, man. Fireball burns your targets and blasts them a step back. That's lit. Spend one guild seal. I only have one guild seal, so why as well spend it on it? Man, I'm heated right now, man. Fuck mechanics. There is a great power. God damn, that pisses me off. I'm a good kid, I'm trying to live my life. People are just gonna fuck you over, man. I would have to say the mechanics are probably the most like skeeziest, sleaziest scumbags in the fucking world. Like I understand. You have to make a, a living. What am I doing? Okay. <clears throat> I understand you have to make a living, but like, why? You, like, you don't have to rip people off. You know what I mean? Like, be a fair, honest. Like, eighty dollars an hour of labor. What the fuck is that? Well, do you crazy? Do you feel any I don't feel it. All right, back. I'm in the catacombs. Supposed to be our only way of getting out of here. You might have mentioned that earlier. I gotta cast a spell on these hoes, guys. How the fuck do I cast it? Okay, B. Oh! Ah! I feel magical. This music, man, is like making me feel good inside. You really are a hero. I never doubted it for a second. Well, of course, neither did I. Still, all right, we gotta go down the catacombs, our underground tunnels. I want to fight somebody, man. Got the homie. I got the dog with me. What's his name? Did I name him last episode? I don't know. Let's name him Quan. The dog's name is Quan. Looking into the abyss. The abyss of darkness. Ah. Alright. Let's go. I wanna fight somebody, man. Rich Omi! What is up? Quan. Other than leaving the castle far behind us, which I wholly approve of, obviously. It's simple. Right. Well, what was that? I kinda scared. <laughs> What's down there? I guess not. Let's follow Walter. Cause he knows what he's doing, guys. Yeah, Walter has a gun on him. He's packing that heat dummy. Fuck it is, you heard me. Don't come at Walter with that drama. He'll shoot you up and your family. What the fuck? Am I literally gonna fight bats? Why are you shooting bats? This is retarded. Oh my god. Hey! Fuck these bats, man. Alright, the bats are dead. They won't stand a chance. Are you serious? Cool. We're good. Excellent. Did you see that, Jasper? Did you see it? Indeed. Alright. I was trying to figure out that move. Escape the castle throughout the underground tunnels. Foul the sparkly goodness. Quan, how you feeling? Dude, Quan's looking a little hungry, bro. He's looking a little famished. He needs some grub. Come on, guys. Stop walking so fucking slow. Oh, I'm tripping. I know I'm a hero. I'm Prince Evan. Get the bitches. Of course. Yo, I'm a real thug. I really cut her off. I cut Elise off. I legit had her executed. Fuck, man. Yo, I gotta kill my brother, though, because that's petty. He killed my one of my hoes. Jesus, God, these bats, man. Fuck off. Well, that was cool as shit. Alright. My cell phone's ringing. Oh, my... This is so retarded. I don't want to fight fucking bats. You can deal with these bats. It's like Naruto. Naruto. I don't know how you say it. Naruto, Naruto. I love Naruto. I can't even say it now. Naruto. 
I love Naruto. I say however the fuck I say. I don't give a shit with how you're supposed to say it. Another impressive display to think. This morning my job consisted of Let's go through the water. Let's go through that water. And a midnight snack for bats. <laughs> You'll get used the to water. You might want to cover Rich Homie! Me. Yo, I feel like I'm in like Pirates of the Caribbean or something, man. Like pirates are gonna pop out. Oh wait, what do you know? More fucking bats! Fuck these bats. Bitch! Yeah, they're getting me, man! Do the area of effect attack. AoE. Back to my World of Warcraft days. You guys all know what I'm talking about, right? No, you probably don't, because you probably didn't play World of Warcraft. You aren't as cool as I am. I'm joking. I was a loser as a kid, man. You know how bad it was? So when I was like 14, I played World of Warcraft for like two years. I was so addicted to that game. Not even like, oh my god, he's fucking, there's like three bats. Are you shitting me? Fucking die. There you go, okay. So, when I was like 14, 14 like 16, I played World of Warcraft, right? I was so addicted to that game that I would literally fucking lock myself in my room and like it was so bad that like the sunlight like I would never sleep the sunlight would like bother me so much that I put a fucking like blanket over my window so the sunlight couldn't come in I'm telling you it was so bad like I was like what am I doing with my life like one day I just kind of like hit me I was like holy shit Evan you need to get your shit together like you're a fucking loser that's when I stopped playing video games for a long ass time then I found skateboarding and it changed my life forever I'm joking but it probably really did I met a lot of cool people I'm just rambling. I think I'm about to do like some cult shit. Cast a spell on your mama. I look magical, man. Oh my god, look at me. I got fire coming out of my hands. Where'd I go? It's got abducted by aliens. It's the X-Files in this bitch. Ah! Yo! I forgot his name. What is this Call him Abraham. No. I'm not Abraham. George Washington. George! What happened, man? He's old as fuck. He Probably had a mini stroke. It, but I never thought it was a real place. Well, I don't believe it. Jasper, this book. This book. There's a note with your name on it. Look. <sighs> That's not possible. For Jasper? Well, I grant you it is possible, but it must be of a Of course it's my book, man. Oh, don't be a dolt. The old king must have left it here for you. What's it called? The book How to Slay the Poo-Tang. 101. <laughs> this really is most remarkable. Everything that we could possibly... This, this board reminds me of, um... What's that game called? Oh my god, it was a game where, like, you literally, like... World Civilization? World, world Civ? Or something like that. You would like fight. You would like build like a like a a castle or a place, and you would like fight other like castles and shit. I don't know what I'm talking about. Never mind. Marvelous, right? We can use that. We'll have plenty of time to explore this place later. Right now, we have a rather large task. A rather large task in my pants, boy. Ah! <laughs> yeah, let me grow up for real. There are people there who would make Oh my god, stop bullshitting. Let's go, Quan. They won't offer their allegiance the Fuck you get out of here. But they despise Logan. Everybody decides is my brother. They fuck my brother. Them. It's a hero. Very good. Very good. Very nice, very nice. Sanctuary. No doubt we will need to make full use of its facilities. Right, alright then. Find Miss Yo, stop talking, let's go. Alright, interact with the map table. Use. Now that looks like the dweller camp in Mist Peak. Just there. press X to fast travel to the dweller camp. And you should be taken there. Just I guess I gotta go to the dweller camp. Fast travel. Hell yeah. Oh my god, I'm fucking tired. The dweller camp. It's cold as fuck out. Work. Good. I'd forgotten how bloody cold it is up here. All right. Come on. Yeah, I think I'm, I feel like I'm in Skyrim. Talking about Skyrim, 
If that game was backwards compatible, I would play the fuck out of that on my channel. Yep. It may not look like much. Why the fuck? I'm gonna hold his hands. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, oh, wait, 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 wait! Let go, let go, let go, let go! I'm gonna pull a bitch's hands. Hey, wait, wait, wait! Hey! Got the honeys. Walter, you know I say pulling bitches. We can't hunt thanks to the king. What are we going to do? I don't care, but I'm about to get some Putin nanny. A proud old sod. I'm joking. Let me stop playing. Let go of me, bitch. Bye. You look hella depressed. Especially to a prince. Perhaps it's best if I speak to him alone first. You know. I probably wouldn't be so damn cold if you didn't have these bald ass heads. Something slightly less princely. That's depressing. All you're eating is weak as snow. I only have a little bit the of fuck? It should be enough. And maybe you can spread what's left among the people. They need it more than we do. Where can I find clothes? Uh, You'll find someone willing to take that money off. True. You. Now, wish me good luck. Buy more appropriate clothes. Yeah, what the fuck? Why can't I go in there? Oh, I gotta buy clothes now. Sorry, guys. I know you're king and all, but I don't have a lot of money. I gotta worry about myself. You you can survive off that snow a little bit longer. Shit won't hurt. Put some dirt in there. Get some pro. I'm joking. Let me fucking stop playing around. If we don't get some food, hello. I look like a pirate. Please look around. Look around. Oh, good. Good. Thank you. Hello, sir. This is Jasper. Return to the sanctuary. Hello. Ah, hello. Now, in I'm gonna see my progress. Is a dressing room. Step through. And the hell? What happened? How do I see you? Um, I guess you go through here. I've taken the liberty of laying out your clothes on these mannequins. Okay. Should serve as convenience. Let's wear the pirate suit, man. Woo! During your travels. Now, why don't you change into your new dweller outfit? Where, man? Okay, exit. Okay, cool. There you are. You okay, I thought I, I wanted to point this out again. So, I don't know if you guys watched my Alien Isolation series on my channel. <clears throat> so I explained in the last episode that I literally had to replay the, the previous episode before the last one, before the third one, the second episode. I had to replay that level fucking twice. So, I had to do the same thing on this fucking game just not too long ago. I had to replay the last level because it didn't fucking save. Some of these games, man, are saving by themselves. We're 2016 now. Let's fucking go. Alright, we're back in the game. We're icy as shit. We're about to pull Halipoon. It is time to meet this Sabine that we've I'm joking. Alright. Why would I wanna why would you wanna hold hands with a stranger? What sense does that make? Please, we're starving. Alright, I'm back, Walter. Hell yeah. I look bald as shit though. I don't like that. I've spoken to Sabine. Explained everything, and he's well. I told you he takes some convincing. Come on. Talk to Sabine. Sabine. Look like a woolly mammoth. Out of the Quad. Reach out me. Can't see a thing. So royalty walks into our home. A what the hell? No less. You're a long boy, boy, them toes crusty as shit with those long ass what toenails, you boy. Do you like what your brother has done to us? So everybody, what's up with everybody these thick ass beards? Trying to square up, bro. Can you try to catch these hands? My eyes are big as shit. You have my word. We don't take much stock in words around these parts. We're simple folk. El Chapo. Proof. <laughs> oh my God. Come on, man, stop talking. Can I skip this shit? Fuck this, whatever. It's Follow nice Walter again. I talked to the Sabine. But anyway, I know the place he mentioned. Your father built the chamber. We gotta go to the chamber. 
Albion's greatest seat. Quan's hella. Quan's wild, wilding out on these hoes, dummy. Just show the old librarian your guild seal. You'll know what it means. I'll try to find out more about these mercenaries. Walter, I'm a little cold. My arms are exposed. You're all nice and like. Well, never mind. Your forearms are exposed too. But you're big and fat. Oh. I always wanted that. Do dogs get cold? Like, I don't really have all that fur and stuff, but like. They still, I wonder if they still get cold. It makes a nice Yo, I want to play Skyrim so bad now. I swear to God, if they, I'm telling you guys, if they bring that game back. I'm playing it. I don't know how I would go about making a series out of that. Because that game is long as dick. But. I'll find a way. If there's a will, there's a way. So I gotta find the librarian. Librarian. Fuck. Oh! So yeah. Back to the, um. The, uh, what was I talking about? The fuck. The car, the uh, inspection thing. So, I had to, I drove all the way down there, right? So, I drove to, I don't, a lot of you guys probably follow me or live in Maryland. So, I live in Parkville. So, I had to drive all the way down the middle river. So, for you guys who don't live in Maryland, um, that's about like a 25 minute drive, right? So, I drive all the way down there and then, I, and then all that shit happened. So, I just gave him my car so he can fix it over the weekend so I pick it up. And I didn't really think about it and I was like, fuck, how am I going to get home? So I'm like in the middle of Middle River, like not like the best area to be around. And holy shit! I'll continue that story in a minute. We gotta fuck these wolves up. They look mean as shit though. They're dripping blood. Yo, Kwame, homie, Quan. Dude, protect your master, man. Fuck those dogs up, bitch. Bitch, I'm the last Airbender, ho. Ah. At least dogs don't want to die. Can I like, do I got a sword or anything? Thanks, Quan. Thanks for helping me out a lot. Fucking bitch. Anyways, so I realized that I'm not, I don't have a ride home after I give him my car. So I'm like, huh, how the fuck am I gonna get home? So call my mom. She's like, I can't get you, Evan. I'm at work. I was like, shit, fuck, that blows. And I call my brother. And he's like, oh yeah, I'll come and get you. And then he's like, oh wait, I'm getting pulled over by the cops. So he gets pulled over by the cops, and he couldn't get me. So then I call my girlfriend, and she got me. But if she wouldn't have got me, I would have the wait. I would have the wait in like the kind of like a bad area for a mean ass minute, probably to like five o'clock. And I had work at six today. So another moral of the story: think before you do shit. Don't just do it. Yo, I am murdering these dogs. They look hella skinny. Why are they so skinny? You know Quan's eating good over here. He don't look famished. It's like a deathly ass trail just to go to the library. Shit. I just wanna get a book, man. I don't wanna fucking find no wolves. Alright, guys. What do you know? More wolves! Gotcha. Quan, what are you doing? I thought dogs were supposed to like help their like master and stuff. Like if you were like close to death, like they would like save your life or something. But apparently not. He's fucking retarded. I heard this the other day. Like, don't you know how they say like, like if you are like if you're hurt, like your dog will try to help you, or like if you die, like your dog will like stay by your side and like will pretty much die with you and all this shit. Well, like apparently, like oh, what do you do? He found something. Apparently cats, they will eat you. Eat you, eat you. And yeah. Isn't that crazy the fuck to think about that your cat will fucking eat you? What's up? So your boy is back. But yeah, isn't that crazy that you're... That... No, I don't want to tell my pet. So anyways, isn't that crazy that you can get like... That your cat will eat you? 
I think that's pretty fucking crazy. That's a fucked up pet. What kind of pet do you want that was gonna that's gonna think about like plotting like plotting like to kill you? Like how? That is terrible. Like I wouldn't be able to sleep at night. Like after after hearing that, I was like, fuck. I don't like I'm allergic to cats. So I don't have a cat. But, like even being around a cat, I'm, like I feel like they're like they're plotting like like your death. Like oh, I'm gonna eat them this way or like something. Like you know what I mean? That's fucking crazy to think about. So. Word of advice, ever apocalypse ever happens, kill your cat, because they're going to eat you. So we're in, like, some, like, fuck we at? I love how it just stops snowing. That's pretty cool. Going to the library. Going to get me a book. Alright. Is that supposed to be my brother? That looks nothing like my brother. Alright. Let's interact with like a little kid. Oh, can you, you can develop a relationship? A reliable way to gather a few belts is by simply interacting with people. Try it. Sure That's a mean ass burp, dummy. You ever need money, you just visit the pool, broker. Congratulations! Getting what the fuck? That was so dumb! No, I don't want to belch again. That was rude. How the hell did I gain a, a point from that? Everybody looks like mean-ass pilgrims in this bit. Was that say Gay Gary? Oh. Pfft. I'm tripping. Let's go to the library. Enough talking. Enough bullshit. Let's go! Who am I even meeting here? Uh, I don't know who I'm meeting here. The library is closed by order of the king. What the fuck? Drinks, I just walked all over here. You tell me this shit is closed. Okay. <clears throat> this bitch is open. I'll break my fiery powers upon your ass. A real visitor. I, I'm afraid I was speaking the truth. King Logan has closed the academy. I'm little more. Than Fuck King Logan. These days. I'll show you my guild seal and you'll treat me with some respect. Holy shit, that's big as fuck. <laughs> what if he pulled out his dick? What if the guild seal was on his dick? Wouldn't that be funny? Every time he had to show everybody, he had to pull out his penis. You shall seal my. <laughs> you shall see my seal. Oh, my. Uh, please. Come this way. Your father told me that one day a child Follow the librarian. I want to fight people. I want to fight people, not dogs. I can kill dogs. It was he who founded the academy, of course. I Where are we going? He would react to see it in its All right. state. Open the door to the re Here we are. I can't. Okay. I can't tell you how Open the door. Researchers and professors have studied this door. <laughs> open the door. There was only one thing that would ever open it. The penis of Prince Evan. What if he like pulled it? <laughs> Wouldn't that be crazy if he opened it with his penis? Oh, I got the seal, man. Because I'm Prince Evan. Yeah, I'm still heated about that whole car thing, man. I can't get my head off of that. God damn. I had a feeling that shit was going to fail. It's like you just have that feeling and you're sitting there like praying like, please God, please God, let it work, please God. And you're just like, fuck, it didn't work. Man, life sucks. Sometimes I like, I like, I just think like, some people have so much better than me. Like, it's not fair, man. It's not fair. But in the end, I'll be a better person. So find your father's treasure for Sabine. We got to find... Old Grandpappy's porn. The old uh, vintage porn. Alright. Maybe I'll get to meet some like dragons or some shit. Something cool I can fight. Maybe a giant ass spider. Because these spider webs are big as shit. Okay. Okay. What is that? Can I get a sword? 
I believe that amazing device is what is known as a flip switch. You guys are hard. However, on the subject Charge it up. Pipe it up. Pipe it up. Pipe it up. You should come back as soon as you possibly can. Whoa! That was cool. This sanctuary contains an armory within which there are some truly remarkable weapons, heroic weapons, which your Hell yeah. left for you. This way. Oh shit. I'm going to the armory. What do I got here? Now, admittedly, these weapons don't appear particularly impressive yet. However, do I want a hammer or a sword? They actually change as you use them, becoming more deadly and developing fantastic properties. Um, living weapons and the way in which you fight with them determines how... Let's use the hammer, because that seems more badass and it seems different. Oh, we can name it? No way! Yeah, what should I name it? Oh, I got it. I got the perfect name. Oh my god. The Poon Slayer. No. Either weapon is fine. All down to the No side. way. All right. Equip it. That hammer should. <laughs> the hammer. <laughs> I'm gonna be hammering hella bitches. Well, now that you are properly armed, you All right. be much better prepared for whatever awaits you beneath Rightful Academy. All right, we're back in the game. Got my 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 uh, poon slayer hammer. You know what I mean? These is by hitting them. Your new weapon should serve that purpose. Ably. Woo! That bitch is icy. Yes. Got the poon slayer. Got Quan, and I got my magic fire. Yo, I'm like the baddest motherfucker in here. I look like a pirate, the last Airbender, and all that shit. Yeah, why, they have me fighting the dumbest shit. Like, what am I fighting? I'm fighting like... Oh, never mind. Yes! We get to fight some shit. Yo, I'm gonna fuck him up with the Poon Slayer, man. The Hollow Man does not want the Poon Slayer. Yo, break out the sword, man. Fuck you. Come on. Come on, you can't take it. I'm trying to get my body game up, dummy. You hear me? Ah, you get it, my body game. I'm funny. I got two... Yo. Alright, boom. Boom. Yeah, this guy has a big ass, like, butcher's knife. Let's use some, like... Boom! Got his ass. Got his ass. These guys are wild. Yo, I'm about to use my, my, like, my... I'm gonna have to hold it for a long ass time. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Go! No! Holy shit, that was crazy. Did I die? Oh, you can dodge too? Dude, fuck these guys, man. Yes. Yes. I got like hella bodies with that Poon Slayer. Put that baddie away. Don't want nobody steal it. Dude, Quad is a badass dog. He's a terrible dog. Like, he hasn't done anything. He just sits there and watches. Watches. And then I bet if I die, he would run away. He's like disproving my everything I've said. I've good. I've said about dogs so far in this episode. What do I gotta do? Oh god! Don't fall off. Oh, I gotta use my my fire. Okay. What the fuck? That was weird. No. Come on. What do I gotta do? How do I get over there? I'm scared. Oh, this is a treasure trust up here. Gonna get me some money. What we got in here? It's like the link. I can't do it. I don't know. Those, I haven't played Legends of Zelda that much. But when he opens the chest, it makes a song. You know what I'm saying? All right, for. From time to time, you'll come across items that are a little use to you, except as gifts. Okay, I couldn't even read it. Oh, he's got a dig spot. Dig, dig, dig me up something, bro. What do you got? 
Yo, dig me up something. Oh, right, where are we going? Where are we going, Quan? I'm following you, buddy. Where are you taking me? It hey, wasn't I down here already? Hey, what you digging up? Yeah, where the fuck did the shovel come from? That shovel's big as shit, you can't even hide that. It's bigger than my battle axe, my poon slayer. What'd I even get? Alright. I think I got gold or something. Back up here, like, and I gotta figure out how the fuck do I get over there? Okay. Maybe if I just jump, maybe something will pop out, and like another stair set like this one just magically appeared. Alright, so. It looks like I gotta go this way. Maybe if I tell him to fetch. Go ahead, fetch! Fetch! Um, what the fuck? No, oh god, I thought he was really gonna do it! <laughs> Wouldn't that be crazy if he fetched off the cliff? Okay, yeah, I just had to. Oh my god! Yo, these guys don't want it, man! They don't want it! Yo, get off of me! See, look, look at him. What kind of dog are you, fucking Quan? Jesus. We got more goodies. We got more goodies. What we got this time? We got that love potion. Y'all feel me? Drink the potion to cast the summon creature spell. In which we will okay. Well, I got a creature now. Oh, what the hell? Yo, fuck these guys, man. Alright, let's go this way. Get more tread. Oh my god. What we got in her? What we got in her? Got us some nice military gloves. Let's look accept it. Alright, um. Go this way. Uh, get us some more treasure. Alright, what's in here? Pussy! <laughs> Drink this person to cast slow time spell. Okay. I'm getting hella shit. Go straight. Oh! The boys are back. They don't want it. Yo, these guys are too easy. I want like a challenge, man. Hold up, hold up. We them boys. We making noise. Hold up. I can't get over these big ass spider webs. I'm scared of that because I, I know for a fact a big ass spider's gonna pop. Oh my god. Okay, <laughs> how is that safe? It's <laughs> it said when you're overlooking a ledge and you an A like appears, it's safe to jump. That was like, like us. Okay, that was unreal. Like that was like a fifty story drop. That was probably dramatized, but and he just jumped down too. Like it was nothing. What the fuck was that? Man, is this one good too? Can we dive? Yeah, let's dive. In that shallow ass water. Definitely would have died. I'm getting the Poon Slayer all wet. Ah! <laughs> Can we dive? I found a gem. Found a common gem. Alright. Alright. <laughs> Hunga, bada bunga, bunga. 
I open the door. I open the door. Oh boy. Oh shit. The boys are back. Got the spells out. Bam. Bam. Yo, that's badass. I'm not even looking at him killing him from behind. Fuck it is, bro. Fuck it is. Yo, these guys are too easy. Challenge me, man. Come on. You can't touch the Poon Slayer. Jesus. Thought you would learn. They haven't. Alright. Come on, man. Let's find this treasure already. I'm walking for a mean ass minute now. My legs are tired. And what do you know? More fucking bats. So I have to kill them now? Hey, fuck these bats. I'm not gonna waste my, my fiery goodness on them. They don't deserve my fire. Fuck you. Okay, so he does do something like effective. Your dog growls when enemies are near. Oh my god, he fucking molly the shit out of me. Boom! That was kind of cool, I'm not gonna lie. I shot fire at his face. Come on, stop being. You're, like, you're just like a nuisance. You're not even like hard to fight, you're just annoying. Got him. Got him. Got him. Boom. You just gotta leave me alone. Alright. Holy shit. That thing scared me. Alright. Yo, I kind of miss Elise, man. Kind of miss her. Kind of miss getting that mad action. Tapping the, the booty. You heard me. Maybe she'll make a guest appearance in this episode. Probably not. Do I have to hit it? What do I have to do? Well, it seems that was only partially correct. According to the book, only blue switches require melee weapons. Got it. I thought I had it. And to activate yellow switches, you must shoot them with a firearm. Fortunately, that's What do I have to do? indicated where some firearms were located, and these weapons, well, they must be What do I have to do? Please return to the sanctuary as soon as you can. Oh. Ah, so the weapons in question were also left for you by your father. They are in the armory. Okay. I guess that's it. Can I save it? I'm gonna fucking end this episode here. Is this how you save it? Probably not how you save it. Um. This one? I don't know. I'll figure it out. But yeah, this is gonna be it. This, uh, uh, obviously, can't talk. This is gonna be it for this episode, guys. Because I'm like pushing like 45 fucking minutes on this episode. <laughs> but again, hope you guys enjoyed. Again, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Again, comment in the comment section below. Let me know how I'm doing. Let me know if you enjoy this series. And let me know if you want to see another episode from me from this series. The next episode should be good. Hopefully, Elise makes a guest appearance. And we slay the poon with the poon slayer. So again, until next time, guys. Peace.